So I'm at Cheltenham Open Door and Rosie is famous uh, because she was featured on the Tesco advert. Oh yeah, that makes me totally, I'm a movie star. When did, they, when did they approach you about that? Uh, a couple of months ago, it took them a little while to get it organised and then they sent a camera crew in a couple of weeks ago. They were here all day. Oh, oh it looked fantastic. Do you have to keep cooking? Cooking and cooking? Yes, cooking and they... cooking. <laughs> and it was awesome because they he was videoing and showed me what he was doing and even something that's quite ordinary looked amazing at once he'd you know, done it with all the... <laughs> it the is videos. amazing, Rosie, <laughs> what you do. So, Christmas is coming. What's yeah. your plan then for here for Christmas? So we moved to St Luke's at Christmas, yeah. so we'll close here um, end of next week, move over to St Luke's and we're open from the lunchtime on the 24th until lunch, just after lunch on the 27th, continually, um, with overnight beds as well. So and do you, need, yeah. do you need some more volunteers or you've got loads? We've got loads, of, well we've done the volunteer stuff, so the volunteering clothes and we assigned everyone, had lots of lovely people volunteer, um, so now it's just things like, things we really missed this year are tins of sweets, you know like tins of chocolates and sweets? So it's, tins um, of chocolates and tins of sweets, that's what we want. Not one, not Team. one. Um, okay. And yeah, and we, we've really struggled this year because a lot of the things that got donated to us um, in previous years have gone to food banks this year. So we've really lost, um, we've missed out on tins of food. So tins of like tin, uh, we've just ham or tuna, loads. stuff like that. So yeah, so okay. making food parcels. But in terms of Christmas, like things like pop, the fun things are what we miss this year. Like fizzy pop and chocolates and sweets. And okay, Chartnam Open Door like need fizzy pop, sweets, chocolates. Yeah. So Martin, how long have you been coming here? Uh, regularly, I think since about September 2009. <gasps> Flip! And where do you live? Hatherley. So you walk all the way from Hatherley? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh. No. <laughs> I can't walk very far without having to take a break. No, I get the bus. Right. Yes. And you come over in for the lunch? Oh, yes. And the company as well is nice. Because yeah. I live by myself since I lost my mum yeah. in 2001. And um, my life would be very lonely if it wasn't for these yes, nice lunches to come to. Yeah, and whenever I come in here, everyone's really friendly. I had a big hug from a man earlier. Yeah. So if you want a hug, come here, I said. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's a great atmosphere and the food looks amazing. It is nice. And on a cold day, when you come here and get a warm meal, I would say this is like an oasis in the desert. Oh, yeah, fantastic. Nice? You've heard me say that. Yes. 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 And Martin, what did you do when you were, um, you know, a young man? <laughs> Yeah, well, I was in the civil service for 13 years. Did you say No, no, no. In the Avenue Valuation Office. But after 13 years, I was dismissed on grounds of inefficiency. Oh. Oh, Thatcher, they're looking at people more critically. Oh, I see. Yeah. And, and so Christmas time, were you going to St. Nicholas for your lunch? St. Uh, St. Luke's, yes. St. Luke's? Because Christmas would be very lonely for me yeah. uh, by myself. Christmas is a great get-together time for families. Yeah, but yeah. when you're not in that situation, yeah. it's not so good. Yeah, yeah. So, very well, all through the year they do a wonderful job. Yes. But uh, I think their work at Christmas is even more valuable. Absolutely. So, we would like sweets, chocolates and pop to make it even more fun. Okay. Thank you, guys. See you in 2019. Bye. Wave, Martin. Bye.